Hi friends, welcome back to my channel. I'm so happy you're all here. And in today's video, I have a wantable unboxing and try on to share with you. I will leave all the details of wantable down below in the description box for you. And I know you're here to see the unboxing and try on. So let's just go ahead and jump right in. Okay, friends, I am so sorry. I cannot show you the bundle because somehow I thought I was filming it and I wasn't and then my camera ran out of storage space. So anyways, I apologize. So we will go ahead and let me show you everything that they sent. The first thing I wanted to show you is a little pair of stud heart earrings, silver. Come on camera, there we go. And these are cute, so depending on what the price is, it could be a possibility. And I'll have to see what they're made of, because sometimes if like in, inexpensive earrings can irritate my ears, so we'll just have to see about those. But they're cute. Okay, we have first this pretty purple tank, and it's a V-neck, looks like a little racerback style in the back, and it's that nice like drapey soft fabric. So I do like the feel of this right from the get-go. So, and I don't have anything this color. It's not a color I'm usually drawn to, but we'll go ahead and give that a try. The next item is a little t-shirt dress. And it's got a cute detail on the sleeves where they're like knotted at the bottom and then kind of open. So we'll have to see how that looks. And it's just like a little crew style. I think I liked this on the stream. Um, couldn't get a real close up of the pattern when I liked it, but there is the pattern of the dress. So we will try that. Next is this little button down white shirt. It's got the collar, it buttons down all the way. But the thing about this shirt is that it is that, um, feels like t-shirt material. It is not like a crisp white shirt. This reminds me a lot of one I ordered from Walmart, a long sleeve one that I really do like. So we'll have to see how this looks on because this could be cute. The next is this little hunter green tank. It's the ribbed fabric and it's kind of got the crossover styling. And from looking at this, I'm holding up the size. I think this is a large. And this is going to be one of those extremely clingy tanks, which I, I don't like. So we will try it, but chances are I'm not gonna feel comfortable in this here. Next, there are a pair of Liverpool shorts in this like beige, like they, they feel like denim. And they have on the back the little flat pockets and the little pork chop pockets in the front. So these could be cute and depending on the price because I, find it hard to spend, you know, 50, 60 dollars on a pair of shorts, but if they're really great, who knows. And then lastly, they sent a pair of skinny jeans. And I have to be honest, I do not need any more skinny jeans. Um, but I have been told that if you put in your requests for some of these subscription boxes that you don't want something, the algorithm does not see the don't and they just see whatever the item was that you listed and send it. So I don't know how to get around saying that I don't need any more skinny jeans because I've tried saying it and I still get, keep getting sent skinny jeans. So, um... We'll see if these are long enough. If you are new to my channel, I am 5'9", so I always do need longer length in pants and jeans. But who knows, I've said that before that I didn't need jeans, but if these look incredible on, you know, obviously I would consider them. So we will try the jeans. So that is everything that they sent me. I will be right back with the first outfit. All right, here is the first outfit, and I think I said this tank was purple in the unboxing. Clearly it's not purple, it's a magenta color. And let's go ahead and we will start with this tank here. So it is that nice drapey fabric, and it is a little bit longer, so it kind of comes down and covers over your bottom. Comes up a little bit on the sides. And then as you can see, 
it's got the racer back styling. I still have just my regular bra on, so obviously you'd need to get one of those clips to bring your bra in or, you know, do a, a T-back bra because it, your straps definitely show with this one. But it doesn't seem to be showing underneath. Oh, it is. I'm sorry. Um, it's kind of low underneath the armholes too. So apparently this one wants to show your bra a lot, but I think it is kind of a cute um, color uh, like I like the color and I do it feels wonderful. I love Tanks like this that just kind of skim and I'll have to see on the footage how I like it um, I will say that these longer tanks I like how they look with jeans and pants, but when I'm wearing shorts I sometimes don't like the longer style tank so I might bring this up into my closet and try it on with like a couple of pair of jean shorts that I have just to see how it looks because sometimes I'm not sure I really like that look. I like them, you know, obviously you can tuck the front in but then the back is still long or I don't know, I'll have to work with it just to see if I like it with shorts. But overall I do think it is a cute tank. So that is the first piece. All right, now we will go on to these Liverpool jeans. And these are long enough. Look at this. I mean, they are pretty long for skinny jeans, which if you've been watching my channel for a while, you know this is like a big thing that when they, they fit like that, these are a long pair of jeans. So she did great with that. They are the mid-rise styling, regular five pocket. I do like how they fit and they're very comfortable. I'm just going to really have to give some thought if I want to add one more pair of skinny jeans and then obviously look at the footage and your comments will let me know if you think, I mean, are these worth keeping when I already have a lot of skinny jeans? Should I go ahead and add one more pair? Are these like just ones I must keep? I'm not really sure yet, but I do like them. Overall, I think they fit really well and they're cute. All right, so that is the first outfit. I think I'm gonna go ahead and try on the little white button-down shirt, keep these jeans on, and I'll be right back with that little white short sleeve button-down shirt. All right, I have the little camp shirt on. And like I told you, it is the feel of like a very soft t-shirt, which is really nice on this. The little collar, it buttons all the way down. I do have the front tuck in just because I wanted to see how this would look. But the back, you can see, is pretty long. I mean, it covers completely your bottom. So this does have a long back. The issues I'm running into are this style sleeve. I think it's kind of on that cap sleeve territory. And it just, I don't think, is very flattering on my upper arms. I'm sorry for those of you longtime viewers. You have heard me go on and on about how much I hate how cap sleeves look on my upper arms. But I think this is another one of those shirts that just isn't very flattering. I just feel like it hits at the, the widest part and just kind of doesn't make them look their best. So that is an issue with this. But... I do think this is a cute top, and for a lot of you, this might be something you would want to request in the stream. It is incredibly soft, it is incredibly light. I think it would be cool because it doesn't come up tight underneath your arms, so you don't have to worry about feeling like confining. And I do love that it's made out of the t-shirt material. I'll show you what it looks like. So this is the full length. So it is a little bit on the longer side, I think. But this might be something that some of you would really like because like I said, it does have a very nice feel, very light. I'll have to see from the footage to see how see-through this is. I mean, obviously I have a nude bra underneath it, but I'm not sure how see-through this looks like it really could be see-through. So that might be an issue too. But I don't know. I'm thinking the, the sleeve length is going to be the hang up on this one for me. All right, I'm gonna go ahead and I will be right back with the next outfit. Okay, friends, I have the next outfit on and I'm feeling completely uncomfortable in this entire getup. 
but we will go ahead and we will start with the tank top first. It is that, you know, ribbed fabric and it does have the, the crossover styling and as suspected, this thing is extremely clingy. I mean, it, it's very low cut. You know, my bra just is showing just right now and it's just not gonna leave much to the imag imagination, this tank top. So I know that I will definitely not be getting this one, but just wanted to show it to you because some of you look really good in these, feel comfortable, go for it. So that is the tank. All right, and now we will move on to these shorts. These are Liverpool shorts. And the jeans are Liverpool that I just had on, and I really do like Liverpool jeans. I think they tend to fit me really well. These shorts, I feel, are just too small. This is my normal size 10, but I think I could definitely size up in these because I think they're just a little too snug. I, I don't like how they're, you know, cutting up this way here. but. They are comfortable and I think they're, you know, they're long enough. The length, the short length is okay. I feel comfortable with that. And I actually am not minding the little um, flat pockets in the back. I have a very flat butt and I found when these style pockets were in on jeans, I don't know, maybe it was like 10 so years ago, I actually liked them because they add a little bit of something for us ladies that have a flat butt. So I'm not hating the back pockets on these at all, but I just feel that they're a little too tight everywhere else. I just, I'm not comfortable in these. I'm thinking this whole outfit going to be going back, but I still have the dress to show you. So I will be right back with that. Okay, friends, I have the t-shirt dress on. And first I will show you that little detail I told you over the sleeve where it's got the little cutout and the little knotting, which I think is cute. And it's just the crew neck. And I think I gave you a close up of the fabric before, but it's kind of like a little bubble abstract print. Um, overall, I think the fit of it is okay. But I have to tell you that when I put this on and looked in the mirror, Something about the pattern and the fit is giving me vibes like I'm wearing a nightshirt. And I now that I've thought of that, I can't get it out of my head. And I feel like if I put this on and went out to run some errands, people would be looking at me like, why is she in her pajamas? So I, <laughs> I don't know if I'm crazy to think that, but I'm just kind of getting a, like, it looks like I'm in a nightshirt. Tell me if you think I'm wrong, but that's the vibe that this dress is giving me. But I mean, I think if maybe if it was in a solid color or I don't know, maybe I'm just not loving the fit on me or something. I'm not sure. There's just something off about this, but obviously wanted to show it to you. Okay. That wraps up the try on. I'll be right back with a wrap up. So, and then maybe I can figure out if I'm going to be keeping anything from this box. Okay, friends, I am back and just wanted to give you my thoughts on what I might be doing with this box. What did you think? What did you think about this Wantable box? After looking at these earrings a little bit closer and then seeing that they are $20.50, I honestly don't think they're worth that. So I'm thinking you could, you know, go to target and get a pair for probably like eight dollars of the same type of style so the earrings are definitely be going back i'm just not going to spend that amount on something that i just really don't think is worth it i liked this all right this magenta tank but to be quite honest with you i didn't like love it and i'm trying to be really picky and buy things that i really love or i feel incredible in and this really just didn't do that for me so i'm thinking that's going back this what did you think did you think it looked like a night shirt i can't get it out of my head once i once i thought that forget it it was forever ingrained in there so this dress, isn't this funny? And I liked this on the stream. So it just goes to show you that, you know, was really off on that one. 
this the white button down camp shirt really cute and like it but i just have that hang up on about my upper arms i don't like this sleeve i guess on them so i know that's going back and oh my gosh this tight uh, <laughs> another time i'm going to be you know mortified that i've put this out there on the internet in this really tight tank and then these shorts i thought were just too tight too um, I don't think I want to size up though because I feel like then around the waist they might not be fitting right but I just felt there was something that looked not right about these and definitely sending the green tight tank top back. To be honest with you and you'll probably laugh because the only item I'm remotely thinking of keeping are the skinny jeans and I don't <laughs> need any skinny jeans. But I will say that these were really comfortable. I loved how long they were, which you know is a plus for me when I get jeans that the length is really good. And I thought they were flattering. You let me know. Did you think they were flattering? Because I'm almost, almost thinking of keeping one more pair of skinny jeans and maybe then that will truly be it. I will be done shopping for skinny jeans. Yeah, we know how that goes. But overall, those are my thoughts on this box. So th friends, thank you so much for joining me today. I appreciate that you take a little bit of time out of your day to spend with me, and I will see you next time. Bye.